know who I hate too? Doctors receptionists. <laughs> They're like a kind of panzer division protecting their god. <laughs> I go to a doctor and she'll say to me, what do you want? <laughs> I'm in the doctor's surgery. What do you want? I'd like to see the doctor. Why? <laughs> well, I wonder if you'd help me change the tires of my car. <laughs> you want to see him? Yes. What's wrong with you? I don't know. I'm not very well. If I was a doctor, I'd know what I'm wrong. I wouldn't be here if I was a doctor. Well, you know, he's very busy. Well, in that case, I'll piss off and die. <laughs> and they're mean bastards, aren't they? Those magazines. Jeez, I was reading a magazine the other day. Michael Jackson was still black. <laughs> Truly, I mean, they're, they're, they're educated people, but they, they can't say things. They'll say things, things like, how's the water works? This is a qualified doctor. How's the water works? What are you talking about my dick? What are you talking about? Well, it's just a hundred million. How's, how's the old undercarriage? What do you think I, the airplane? Do you think I land on my crotch every time I come in? How's your blood pressure? What? Your blood pressure, how is it? I don't know. You mean you haven't had any blood pressure taken? He said, I'm old. I said, I'm 56. He said, that's... Are you aware that more, more men in the middle 50s die than any other age? I said, what about the old ones? He said, they don't get there. <laughs> no. No, whatever he said. When he's talking like that, your blood pressure's gone up. It has to go up, for Christ's sake. He's telling you you haven't got long to live. And they, have you seen them? They take out a little black box that looks remarkably like a coffin. <laughs> and they open it up and there's a black armband in there. <laughs> that he puts on me. <laughs> and he straps it and then he goes... <laughs> and it starts to tighten on your arm. Nobody explains it. You think, you think, Jesus, what's happening? I just crushing my arm, no, no, sweat breaking out, no, no. and then you suddenly go, and the thermometer type thing drops down. They said, "Yes, you have high blood pressure." <laughs> I said, "Yes, I have. Of course, I have. You've just given it to me." <laughs> I went to a doctor recently. I had a trap nerve. I had a trap nerve, and he said to me, "What do you think is wrong with you?" I said, "I have a trap nerve." So he said, "All right, let me examine you." He examined me, and he said, you have a trapped nerve. <laughs> that would be 35 pounds. <laughs> and I said, when I came in and said I had a trapped nerve, you didn't give me anything. <laughs> you tell me I've got a trapped nerve, and I've got to give you 35 quid. <laughs> and I'm an ex-smoker. I don't like smokers. <laughs> I'm an ex-smoker. I'm a real... Convert, nasty, ex -smoke. I do not like smoke. You see, there's a full of blowing smoke all over me. And I'm going, don't do that, I don't like it. He said, well, it's not the real nicotine. The nicotine's going into me, it's only the residue. Well, I said, well, I don't like it. He said, well, you drink? I said, yeah, but I don't piss on you when I'm finished. <laughs>